Look at me, 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 look at me now. Fuck, are you kidding me? You're my All right, coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight showdown. All right, so lofty expectations for this matchup as round one gets underway. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but on the other, truly a fighter who can do it. And that guy will usually have the advantage on paper. When you're a striker at this guy's level, that will normally balance out whatever advantage the other guy has. Well, you saw the tail of the tape. He has a reach advantage and made good use of it there with that punch. Hook is there again. He got him. Oh, straight right. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. All right, so one minute into the fight, and I'm not sure these fighters realize that we got three or five rounds tonight. No feeling out process at all. The moment this fight started, these two gentlemen were ready to knock each other's heads off. Choi's now dealing with a cheat cut. Let him go. Time to let those hands go. Can't take any of those. Better check. Back to the body shots now. That one. Right hand upstairs. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if he can follow it up. He's landed that punch over and over again. What's he going to do to follow up? Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Just over three minutes to go. Able to check that kick as well. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Oh, and there's another leg kick for good measure. So doing a really good job with that weapon here tonight. And if you're trying to slow your opponent down, mission accomplished so far. When you can land that many leg kicks, you start to affect the movement. You start to affect the hand. Everything changes when you're blasting someone over and over and over with leg kicks. And you start to see the damage, not only in the legs, but in the facial expression right. of his opponent. Oh, that's a good strike there by Choi. Let's go. Get first, I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Choi. Oh! Oh, straight right! with a right. What a body kick. Some fighters don't check a lot of leg kicks. That one was checked. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one? Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Superman punch. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Well, he's got the longer reach, and he certainly showed it there in landing that straight punch. Cable inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, beautiful knee to the body by him there. Again, we talked off the top about his size advantage, and he put it to good use there. Big calls for Spud's land. Now we get back to range. Man, DC, his hands look good. A lot of volume, a lot of accuracy tonight. He's doing a great job being accurate, but he's also very fast. Look at the hand speed. Right. Let's go. 30 seconds. Let's go. You got it. 
The right hand just misses. Oh, he lands a hook there, DC. That was one of his more significant lands of the fight. He can land that strike over and over again. Choi's cut is getting worse here. Man, is that bleeding. Oh, big punch land. Big head kick land. Five minutes in the books. Well, what a round it was, and how about that flying Superman punch at the end of the round? Not a lot of fighters will try it. He did, he executed. And it worked, right? No discouragement from his opponent to make him not try it. Why not try it? It's working, so why not try it again? If his opponent isn't careful, he will get knocked out and be on a highlight reel for the rest of time. All right, DC, second round is getting underway. Round one, not the round of the year necessarily, but some good in there. And it's not always gonna be. When you have two very talented fighters, sometimes it's very even. That's what you saw in round number one. He's throwing every part of himself in hitting big leg kicks. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas. Oh, and he lands another knee there, DC. He talked a lot to us about his length and his size advantage. Doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter. In this instance, it certainly did. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton, and to watch him punch like this puts a smile on my face. Out of range with that one. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. just misses with the punch by Choi. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, really exploiting his reach advantage as he landed the jab there, DC. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if there's more where that came from. Boxing, boxing, boxing. Once again, making good use of his size as he lands the knee. How good is that right hand? And they set it. Big knee there. Oh! So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Good punch, land. All right, so a nice straight punch there after he caught the leg. He decides to punch out as opposed to going for any takedown. Nice kick. Punch coming, it's blocked. Real nice body play. As he gets close, he's out of the kicking range. He'll suddenly he'll change his stance. Misses with the right hand. Nice punch by the Korean Super Bowl. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more ball. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also gonna be able to land. He's gotta be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Choi's face is a hot mess, man. That cut on his cheek is getting worse by the minute and worse with every strike landed by his opponent. Right hand on point. He's got to whip his hip into that kick. Nice right hand. Keep your hands up. 
And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. Oh, he hurt him bad with a jab. It's such a fast leg kick. Oh, and he continues to pour it on. We mentioned earlier the aggression with his striking. Got to be careful to not gas out here, but at least you have to admire the approach. Well, looks as though his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Nice punch here. Beautiful leg kick throw. Ten seconds to go. Work. Nice body shot. Oh, All right, that horn signifies the end of the round. Let's take us through some replays, champ. And the replays are going to be kicks. That's the story of this fight to this point. He is landing these kicks at will, just driving his shin into his opponent's legs, and it's really starting to slow him down. All right, so back-to-back -back entertaining rounds. We'll see how it goes in this round. We'll see which corner sort of maximize those 60 seconds on the screen. This is what happens when you get very skilled, very evenly matched fighters coming together. Nobody has really taken a lead in this fight. Let's see who does it going to the next one. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Good series of strikes. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh! Punch over the top. Checks the light kick. Lands a glancing right hand upstairs. Big head kick. Ooh wee! Ooh wee! What a right hand by this young man. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. Real quick leg kick. Ooh, what a punch! Oh, combination lands, and it seemed like almost every strike found the target. There. He's so accurate when he decides to attack. It is a sight to behold. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. And that one certainly found the target. Looking to land the right just out of range. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Blocks the shot. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. Really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Oh, that's a nice strike. Try to establish that jab. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Just out of range with the big right hand. Ooh! Combination lands for him. It was hard to see a miss in that sequence. He's put it all together. I mean, everything is just flowing. He's like in a zone. It's like the basketball hoop becomes twice its size. This guy today is looking at focus fits in his opponent. Oh, bleeding from his cheek now. That can't feel good. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. Big punch land. Ooh. Misses again with a right punch. Let's go. We need to score that He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. 
He blocks the punch. leg kicks coming. And he landed the right hand there. The Korean Superboy gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Beautiful head kick. Big right hook coming. It's locked. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Right on the button. Kick to the body by the Korean Super Bowl. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Blocks the shot. Korean Superboy gets caught by the inside leg kick. A few more, and that'll leave him up. All right, let's get to the replays from that previous round, and you gotta think they plucked that flying knee. Huh? Oh, it was beautiful. It was great to see someone be this free in the octagon. See an opening, take anything that shows itself that flying knee was perfectly timed and landed beautifully. All right, next round is underway. You know these are two of the more conditioned fighters on the roster, so cardio is not going to be an issue here. And for some fighters, you know, you can have one of those adrenaline dumps or the cardio abandons you on fight night. Not the case for these two guys. Both look very fresh as we start this next round. Big kick land. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. He's, he's limping now. Choi gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. to the uppercut and he lands to the head. He land a beautiful uppercut right as he comes in close. Lands the right hand. Nice job. This might be the biggest shot of this entire fight. He lands a massive hook to put his opponent on wobbly legs. Choi gets caught with that punch. Just out of range with that right hook. Shot to the body, turned back by Choi. Yes, it looks like it did stun a little bit. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, he might be out. Just over three minutes to go now. Beautiful one. Man, his time is shot nicely. It's like Tom Brady out there. He hasn't missed the target. I mean, you insist on bringing in <laughs> Tom Brady. Stop it. John, stop it. <laughs> Switching stances here. Good stick. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Visibly limping here. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Oh, 
How about that chin? Over and over, he's landed these big body kicks. He loaded up on that right hand, too. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, vicious kick to the outside of that lead leg. You gotta start checking these, You've man. You got to check these kicks, or you're gonna be limping around the octagon very short. Check yourself before you wreck yourself. Chicky, chicky, chicky. Well, DC, no denying he's winning this fight. And it's got to feel pretty good if you're a fighter. You put in the work, and it all comes together on fight. When it all comes together, nothing feels better. To go out there and implement the game plan that you guys have worked on in training camp, and it goes as desired, nothing feels better. Well, pretty good work off of the bottom here by Short. Trying to guard pass here, not today. No, it ain't happening. Good job understanding the transition. All right, less than a minute here to go in our fourth round. Oh, nice job using his strength there to posture up. We'll see what he can do now. He's gonna start looking to land big shots from the top. All right, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you gotta be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Look at the good action that comes from him throwing that kick. Looks like his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Just here moving forward. I mean, they've got to be celebrating. They've got to be happy. Everything's working. But the other side has to be concerned. They have to figure something out, make some sort of adjustment to try to change the tide of this fight. kick just over three minutes now to go in the fight a lot of fighter trying to control posture unable to do so and now he's in a lot of danger he's got to grab that head or he's going to get blasted Choi's attempting to pass here but he's denied by the defense Trying to 
past the guard here, but a nice job by the bottom fighter defensively. Bottom fighter did a fantastic job of following with his hips, making sure he blocked any attempt to get past his guard. Troy gets back up. That was a cutting leg kick. Cheek is only getting worse. His face is a mess. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. All right, under two minutes now to decide this one. All right, it's late in the fight now. I don't need to be a judge to tell you that he is clearly losing. What is a fighter's mentality when you know you need a finish or you're getting an L? This is when you gotta go to the Nate Diaz mentality. Kill or be killed. You gotta throw everything at you. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Joy gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Gotta shore up the defense here, though. Oh, and that is it. Referee has seen enough, and maybe so have we. Your winner by TKO. That was a great performance. Way to land those strikes and go and chase down the finish when you get an opportunity. So a big win for him here tonight and an even bigger statement made by virtue of the TKO. All right, we now go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop to this contest at three minutes, 41 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by TKO, Bruce